Hey beauties, so I know it's been a minute. I haven't talked to you guys in a little bit, but I just wanted to come to you and let you know kind of how my fitness has been going. There's a lot that's been happening in the past week and a half to two weeks, so a lot's been going on. I just wanted to kind of share what's going on with you. Um, so let's see, last time I talked to you, I'm not really sure where I was, um, but I picked up some more locations. Um, I now work for LA Fitness. Um, and I work for a few different locations. Um, with LA Fitness, you work multiple locations, um, as many as you can get, honestly. Um, and with that, I have been substituting a lot. And I have never really been a substitute before. I've never really known how that process is supposed to work. Um, but I'm really glad that I'm able to take on this experience because I really like it. Um, I go to different gyms and when an instructor is not available, I go and teach for them. And so I'm not really committed to them. Um, I'm not really committed to the class, put it like that. I don't typically see a lot of the um, members there at any other class. I typically would just see them there. But um, I've actually seen some of the um, different instruct. I'm sorry, the different members at a lot of the different gyms I've been teaching, which is kind of nice because sometimes um, you get a little frustrated when you have to teach new people all the time because your choreo is old to you but new to them. So it's kind of nice when you get to see some of the people that you've taught before and they're like, hey, she's really, really good or you're going to love her songs or whatever. So it's really a big, just great group of um, women and men that I've been teaching and I'm really excited about it. So um, the biggest thing um, that's been going on for me right now is I am starting to teach at Agnes Scott College. Um, and if you're familiar with the Atlanta area, that is a um, school, a college that is in downtown Decatur. And it is a gorgeous campus and their gym is bomb. They just got it redone. So the floors are new, the sound system is new, it's great. Um, today was actually my information class. Um, where I got to go over the syllabus with the um, students and I got to also um, just kind of talk to them about fitness and what they expect from my class and everything. So I'm really excited. And that um, will officially start in September. But today was just kind of an information session. And they were actually able to take um, or do a few songs for me today. And they were really excited and they had a great time. So I'm really excited to get started with that. Um, what else is going on in the life of me? Um, oh, biggest thing is, um, not just with me, just kind of an overall rule of thumb. Um, whenever you start something, um, and you're trying to make a name for yourself, and you're just trying to get your experience and your exposure out there for people to know who you are, um, you tend to say yes to anything that comes your way, which is great because you need that. Um, it's actually a really good marketing tool for yourself. Um, when you put yourself out there, then you are able to um, let other people know that you're available and that you have skills and that you want to show them, um, show your skills to others. With that though, um, when you say yes to a lot of things, you overbook yourself and I'm in that state right now where I'm overbooking myself because I want people to see me I want people to learn my name I want them to see my face and remember me so I'm out there I'm trying to you know make a name for myself because I'm really excited that I'm in this fitness thing and fitness is still new to me but it's old to a lot of people so I'm like hey do you know Ebony that's me so I'm like let me show you what I can do so with that I have been working just crazy 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 um, today is probably my first day that I probably really, really um, taken it to the next level. Um, so let me just tell you my schedule for today. Um, I taught three classes between the hours of eight and five. Um, they were 60 minute classes and um, I still have one more class to teach later on tonight at seven o'clock. Um, so I would have taught four hours of Zumba today and I feel like I'm going to not make it through the rest of the day. Um, I'm just being honest with you. Um, that's because, like I said, I said yes to everything. Um, and I didn't even really think about myself. I was just like, okay, um, I'm available at this time. I could do this. Sure, you need me here? Okay, great. And then when I actually saw my schedule, 
um, written out in front of me, I was like, whoa, uh, I didn't realize that I had classes back to back to back to back. Um, so in saying all that, you need to make sure that you're taking care of yourself. Uh, make sure that you don't forget about you because you are important in this um, mission and journey as well. Because if you are not able to perform at 100%, you're no good to no one, right? So make sure that you're eating, drinking a lot of water, getting rest, all of that. So now I'm actually doing better. Um, I taught my first three classes, like I said, before one o'clock today. And um, I was able to come home and rest. So if I look a little sleepy, it's because I just woke up. Um, but I was able to get some rest. I was able to nap at least for a good little bit. And now I can restart my day and I can get ready to go teach my next class. So I'm really excited. There's been so much going on. Um, I have new things to get started and try out so I'm really excited about it but I just want to come quickly and let you guys know just kind of where my head's been at what I've been doing where have I been why haven't I been on camera and that's why because I just have so many wonderful things going on um, if you have time um, please make sure I'll make sure to put all my information below but please go on uh, my Instagram that I have um, I do have two Instagrams but I'm only putting one up for this channel specifically um, and it is my fitness Instagram and it is Zumba with Ebony. I'll make sure I put it below. But um, I love to see um, different people's fitness journeys and just kind of seeing where they're coming from, where they're getting to, what their goals and aspirations are. So if you don't mind following me, please go ahead. I will follow you back. Um, I like seeing... Um, people's journeys and just what they're going through because I have my own goals and journeys as well. So I just want to kind of stay connected with people and just see where they're, where, what they're doing and how they're getting there because I love to learn new things. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.